Yo, what's going on guys? My name is Clay and in today's video, we're going to be checking out my best M4 class setup in Modern Warfare 2. If you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button and also hit that like button. Today's like goal is going to be 20 likes. So if you guys could do that for me, I'd really appreciate it and it helps out the channel a bunch. Let's get straight into the attachments. Over on the stock, I'm going to be using the Tempest P80 Strike Stock at Sprint Speed, Aim Walking Speed, Crouch Movement Speed, Aim Down Sight Speed, with the cons being Aiming Stability and Recoil Control. With the tuning, I'm going with three point negative three point thirty five ounces to the weight to add aim down sight speed, and negative two point zero one inches to the link to add aim walking speed. Over on the rear grip, I'm going to be using the Seiken ZX grip. It adds recoil control with the cons being aiming stability. And with the rear grip tuning, I'm going with negative 0.77 ounces to the weight to add aim down sight speed, and negative 0.39 inches to the width to add sprint to fire speed. Over on the underbarrel, I'm going to be using the Edge 47 grip, adds aiming idle stability and recoil stabilization, and the cons being aim down sight speed. With the underbarrel tuning, I'm going with 0.59 ounces to the weight to add recoil stabilization and negative 0.30 inches to the link to add aim walking speed. Now, this is what I found to be most effective when controlling recoil. It is the X10 Havoc 90 muzzle. It adds horizontal recoil control and vertical recoil control. I couldn't really use any other muscle. Like, this one felt the best, honestly. The cons are aiming aim down sight speed and aiming stability. <clears throat> but with the tuning, I'm going to be adding more aim down sight speed, which is negative 0.49 ounces to the weight. And obviously, it adds aim down sight speed. And to help out with the recoil control even more, I added 0.30 inches to the link to add gun kick control. Over on the barrel, I'm going to be using the Hightower 20-inch barrel. Honestly, this is probably the best barrel, this one and the carbon shroud barrel, but I like this one a lot more. It adds bullet velocity, damage range, recoil control, and hip fire accuracy. The cons are aimed on sight speed, movement speed, and hip recoil control. Over on the barrel tuning, I'm going with 0.27 pounds to the weight to add recoil steadiness just to get a little bit more recoil or recoil control and negative 0.25 inches to the link to add aim down sight speed. Like I said, this is probably my best M4 class setup I've ever made, and it's kind of like the Pro class setup, I'm pretty sure. But I if you guys try this class setup out and you like it, please let me know down in the comments. Or if you have an even better class setup than this, please let me know what that is down in the comments. I have a crazy gameplay for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy. Hit that like button, and I'll see you guys in the next one.